Joseph sure YouTube, welcome to the coffee pot. My name is Shishi Zed. Drink the coffee, it'll make you feel better. Bride kneels down in front of her groom on her wedding day and promises to be submissive. And feminists on Twitter lose their minds. They couldn't stand the sight. They couldn't stand the words that were coming out of this chick's mouth. No more wasting time. Let's get it. I will become that woman that builds the home as I follow you, as you follow Christ. That is the only thing that we will do in our household. And I promise and I vow that in heaven mm. they hear. <laughs> On earth I declare and decree I shall be a submissive wife unto you as we continue to do this work of God. Because to us, you know, this is beyond just love. This is about God. Mm. This is about kingdom. This is about our duty, reflecting to the world what true marriage, what God really intends for marriage to be. I honor you, Miles. And I love you with my all, <laughs> with all my heart. All right. They were sick, man. They were sick. Okay. First, guys, this video is one of those where I'm wondering, what do you guys think of that? That's the first thing I'm wondering. First initial thoughts after watching that, you can go back, replay it one more time. Um, but yeah, you see her there on her wedding day. She's on her knees. And uh, people were triggered, man. Let's check out this again into these comments. Straight into these comments. First comment here from a gentleman says, why y'all hating on this lady? She loves her. Man, they didn't like that coffee at all. For example, this woman who says, God said respect, not worship your husband. This is disgusting. And she's got the emojis there puking and she's just disgusted by the sight. I don't see, okay, I'll ask you guys this. We all know if this was a man on his knees declaring what this woman was declaring, would have a bunch of hard emojis in the comment section. If he was saying, I promise to be your protector and to watch over you, and I promise to do such and such, women would be commenting shit like bringing tears to my eyes. Um, he, uh, 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 God, um, I see what you're doing for others. Um, this is the type of marriage I want. This is what I'll submit to, right? The most the, the difficult woman claiming that she's gonna be submissive one day to that man. That's what they're okay with. Society has reversed what we are okay with seeing on screen. We're not okay with seeing women kneeling down and crying and professing their love. Feminism has women today in such a chokehold that that seems cringe and makes them uncomfortable. But if the guy was there on his knees with tears in his eyes crying, because we see those videos all the time, women are like, oh, so beautiful. And he can barely get words out of his mouth and he's expressing how much he loves her, then it's not a problem, right? Now, with that being said, I still don't get why it had to be recorded and uploaded onto Instagram. I think when people have real intimate moments like that, uploaded onto the internet it's gonna be cringe no one no one wants to see it's like the last video i did of the guy and he's like kissing on the girl uh miss hair and you know some people the, the pda stuff online for me and moments like that just seem a bit too much people put too much of their personal lives online my opinion now the comment here says i'd rather mop the ocean should rather mop the ocean than do that we got a chick here saying that smoking I don't know what she's smoking on there. No man in sight in the background. Now the comment says, my husband wouldn't even let me reach the floor, this chick says. In my household, we kneel to God and our ancestors, not humans. Again, guys, w watch this. You traditionally, when you propose to a woman, men kneel, men humble themselves. And I don't think any man is less than for kneeling. I mean, there's some guys who say, oh, I'll never kneel. It's an unusual act for a man to kneel down like that and it means something, right? It has weight to it. But seeing a woman kneel is embarrassing to these chicks, but men kneel all the time. This is humiliating, she says, and degrading herself. It's almost as if she begged for this marriage. Cringe. How is this humiliating? I bet you he kneeled first. I bet you he kneeled first. Now the comment here says, okay, but why on earth is she kneeling? So you have a problem with the kneeling. Now the comment says this marriage is going to survive through it all. No, I don't know. I don't know about that. Right? We can't predict what's going to happen. He might cheat tomorrow. Drink the coffee. It'll make you feel better. 
You might cheat tomorrow. That's the other reason you don't want to put stuff online. I'm not saying this marriage is going to lie. I don't know, man. But I'm saying, aside from posting it online, most of these women have a problem with the kneeling. I think there's nothing wrong that with what was said and what she wanted to do. She's expressing her um, feelings. Now, this commenter goes on to say, do you know why? He's saying this message would go through it all. Because they made God the foundation. She's made God the anchor of her trust. She ain't about what society says a wife should be, but she's about what God said a wife should be. God bless this union a thousand times. Yeah, I wish him the best. And um, I do believe God helps marriages last longer. I do. I worry for some women because oftentimes a lot of these chicks in those situations think the man will never do any wrong. Be ready to work through some shit. Right. Next comment says, baddie stocks are plummeting and feminists catching consecutive l's this is true this week has been great yeah feminists are sick now the comment says it's actually beautiful i get where she's coming from although it makes me incredibly anxious because nowadays relationships don't really work out why don't they work out because women refuse to accept the 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 very obvious fact that you're gonna run into problems that men are different from women i don't want to say it. i don't want to say it, but i have to if for the next 50 years this relationship goes great and this man happens to step out of his marriage this is what this woman thinks of like it won't work out because um she end everything right this is not me advocating for men to step out of their marriage at all but i can't deny the fact that that seems to be a theme in a lot of reasons why women say stuff like um men can't be trusted i'm not gonna get married etc etc now with that being said i hope nothing like that ever happens between this couple and um things work out but marriage is difficult man this comment goes on to say let's stop projecting our traumas onto others another comment here says i won't say anything because i know i'll do this hmm. another comment says i completely agree with everything she said as long as he is following christ she will follow him because that means they will end up in the same destination i agree with this statement and um i only the only thing i hope is when women say this, they don't mean I'm good until I decide you are not following Christ from my perspective, right? Because the Christian walk is an up and down journey. Sometimes you may not feel like you are, feel, right? Like you are following Christ. Who decides that? Does your wife decide that? Because at the end of the day, that's just her playing God. Or do we have grace to look at people and... Who, listen, this is for people who put God at the center of their relationship, right? And to look at people and say, you know what? This is part of your journey and your destination is Christ. I don't know how to feel about the kneeling though. Maybe it shows that she is humbling herself before him. It can't be bad. Another comment here from another woman says, she could have said all that standing. I don't know. This is just cringe. I think what's cringe about it, like I said, is that it's online. It's online, man. Intimate moments online are just going to come off cringe. This is in Hollywood, especially when it's real. You know, it, come, it can come off a bit cringe. Guys, as always, curious to know what you think. Leave your comments down below. I appreciate you for checking out yet another episode of The Coffee Pot. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.